you all for coming here to this morning. This is going to be um, a short ceremony, but a very important one. We're here today to um, honor Judge Diltz, who needs no introduction. He, of course, was uh, the judge in Branch 2 here, this uh, courtroom from 1994 until he retired <coughs> this year. And he obviously served, uh, served us very well during that time. So, and I'm his successor. I'm, I'm uh, extremely proud and humbled to be his uh, successor, and I'm proud to hang his uh, portrait up here in his uh, courtroom today. So, um, you know, I've always thought that um, I want to judge Diltz to uh, watch over me. So now I. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, David. Well, I, I have to say I was a little apprehensive um, about coming in today. First of all, I, I have, do keep up with the shaping. I do that about the trees. Now, the tie is another thing. I don't remember where the last time I wore a tie so I could find my clip. Um, but it comes back after three or four times. So that, no, I just uh, want to remind everybody that Branch Branch 2 was created back on August 1st of 1994, but it's actually had three locations. You know, originally, the first six years, we started off in um, um, Judge Stefan's old courtroom. With the little, I don't know if any of you remember the little tiny chambers, which was more like a hallway. <coughs> Judge Ehlers, I know, remembers, because after six years, before he took office, I snagged Judge uh, Cade's <laughs> Courtroom with the more commodious um, chambers, and uh, that ended up with the uh, Judge Stephens Hall courtroom. So, and then after six years <coughs> there, the second uh, courtroom for Branch Two, then we moved here ten years ago. So, even though the branch itself has been in existence for a little over twenty-two years, this is already the third courtroom that it's been in. Um, I think I mentioned at Dave's investiture that when. You get elected a judge, you think in terms much more of uh, the, the, if you think of it at all, the people that have come before you as Door County judges. And certainly it never occurred to me to think in terms of the branch being any, you know, having any kind of distinction or, or separateness. But after time, um, after 22 years, you start thinking, and after looking at all the uh, pictures of former judges, uh, which the three of us uh, are fortunate enough to have joined, in the back of branch one, you get a little sentimental and you think, well, maybe someday some people will look at this picture, you know, years from now, and uh, wonder who, who that person was or something like that. And um, so it, it does, you know, um, even though it's much more important and your, your thoughts are more being a Dork County judge, perhaps in the future people will look and there will be some sort of a distinction. And to the extent that they do do that, um, Tried to do whatever I could, Dave, to give us a good start in Branch 2. Um, I don't know if history will reflect how that is, but I'm so confident and comforted to know that uh, you're going to build on whatever it is that Branch uh, 2 uh, has developed up to this point. And sometime in the future, uh, I'm also very confident it will be later rather than sooner. Your picture will be up here, right alongside mine, and uh, I couldn't be happier to share it. I appreciate it. Thank you very Thank much. You. Uh, the oh, yeah. The only thing I wanted to add is when I heard that uh, Judge Weber was organizing this uh, this morning, uh, I talked to Judge Jolson. I said, I said too many good things about you. I'm not saying anything more. Uh, but uh, <laughs> but uh, I, the one thing I want to say is uh, he has already begun. Uh, exercising some uh, mediation services uh, here in Door County. In other words, trying to resolve cases that are pending in Door County Circuit Court. He's already settled one of my cases, so <laughs> I will say one more good thing about it. So, uh, I appreciate it. Congratulations. Well, thank you. Hey, also, the other thing I wanted to add is, is that, uh, ironically, it's exactly six months today from the day that I retired, May 11th. Um, but I hope that that six-month time lag uh, doesn't remind people how long it sometimes took me to get out written decisions. <laughs> <laughs>